You can see the SUV at the center of this investigation is right here behind us on Broadway on its side and badly damaged after ramming directly into a cyclist this morning. Surveillance video shows a cyclist riding down Broadway near Ellery Street just after 6 a.m. when a car speeds by slamming right into him and several parked cars before flipping over. I was sleeping and I just heard like a loud noise. It was really loud. It woke you up? It woke me up. The impact sending debris into the street and mangling the front of this truck. Neighbors stepping in to help until emergency responders arrived attempting to save the cyclist, but it was too late. When I looked out, the car was already flipped and then the guy was laying on the floor and they were giving him CPR. It gave me chills. Police sources say moments before the driver had spotted the cyclist trying to break into his car. They began to argue, then things turned physical. We're told by those sources the man on the bike attempted to attack with a screwdriver, instead somehow injuring a woman nearby, then riding off. The car owner pursuing him for a block, driving the wrong way, chasing close behind before hitting him. He was like lifeless. They would move him and... It was sad. It's unclear if the man behind the wheel was hurt. Meantime, investigators gathered evidence all day to find out what exactly happened. Detectives are currently questioning the driver. So far, he has not been charged. In Bushwick, Brooklyn, Rena Roy, CBS 2 News. Video shows a cyclist riding along Broadway when an SUV comes flying across the double yellow line to mow him down. We're stopping the video before the moment of impact, but we can show you moments later when the SUV rolls over. The aftermath tells the story of what happened in between. The SUV rammed the cyclist against three parked vehicles, killing him. Isa Musaid's minivan was one of those vehicles. It's getting crazy. That is my blue car. That is the car of the head. That is mine, the blue one. Musaid manages a deli feet from where the crash happened along Broadway near Ellery Street. He says the scene was horrific just after 6 in the morning when he arrived for work. The sad is like the one you see that the guy he was dying you know, with the bike. It's kind of crazy. But in what's been a deadly year for cyclists around the city, this cyclist versus vehicle incident was very different. The driver of the SUV tells police the 47 year old cyclist was trying to break into several vehicles along Broadway with a screwdriver. We saw a screwdriver among the mangled mess of debris still on the road. A police spokeswoman says the driver of the SUV confronted the would-be thief. She says the cyclist tried to stab the driver during the confrontation, missed, and instead stabbed a female passenger. That information does change how some out here view this deadly crash. God fix him. He the one did it to the lady, so he didn't get away with it. And show you can't do wrong, wrong come back to you. But police are taking a different approach. This is being counted as the 21st cyclist death this year with charges pending against the driver. In Bushwick, Henry Rossoff, Pix 11 News.